Hey friends, I'm Rhiannon from Drawn by Rhiannon and today I'm working on my first wholesale order of the year. It's super exciting to see things that I've made in an actual like real life shop. So I've been working really hard to get some more stockists. Last year I made like a really big push to get more stockists, which was a bit tricky. We're going in and out of lockdown and shops keeping closed and stuff. But I'm getting a really nice list of places building up. I'm trying to get sort of a nice mix of places around the country so that no matter where you are, you can be of easy access of drawn by Rihanna items. That would be really, really cool to have one in like every, every county, that would be amazing. Um, but today I'm working with a new stockist. So this is a beeswax wrap order for Eco Morpeth, which is a new uh, plastic free way shop in Morpeth in Northumberland. So I'm really excited to be working with a new stockist. I'm gonna be making some beeswax wraps for them today. Um, it is absolutely freezing here today. It's currently minus three in Newcastle. So it's gonna be a chilly one in the workshop. I've got so many layers on, hoping that's gonna be warm enough. So let's get started. I'm in the workshop now, AKA my garage, and it is absolutely freezing in here. Oh, I've got the heating on, I've got the oven on for the beeswax wraps, but it's so cold. <laughs> So I'm gonna go through the fabric supplies and have a look to see what beeswax wraps we're gonna be doing. Um, Imogen, the owner of Eco Morpeth, has asked just for a random selection of our most popular designs. So I'm gonna have a little look through and see what designs we're gonna be making today. Okay, so I've picked out some of the most popular designs. I think there's a nice mix of prints to choose from there. So I'm gonna crack on with making them now. I've just discovered the heater has packed up, so I am beyond freezing in here. So I'm gonna be really quick doing this and then head back into the nice warm studio afterwards. <laughs> Okay, so now all the fabric has been waxed and it's been cured, so it's ready now to be trimmed. So what I do is just go around the edge of all of them with a thinking blade to prevent it from fraying. The beeswax wraps are all made i need to make the packaging for them now so each beeswax wrap comes in an envelope just to keep it nice and safe and clean before it goes to its new home um so i need to print the labels off for them and then i need to cut out the little rectangle from each envelope so that you can see what design is inside the envelopes are made of recycled paper and the labels are also made of recycled paper. I'm going to print the labels off in the printer just behind me and then head inside to use the Cricut machine to cut out the rectangles for the envelopes. labels printed out I'm back in the workshop to come and cut them out so I've got a big cutting table here so I use a rotary cutter for cutting these out as well and um, obviously a different one from what I was using earlier this one is just for paper and um, I just find it so much quicker than just doing it with scissors and it's usually neater as well
So that's it. Got the order all done, got these ready to go. I'm going to head up to Morpeth tomorrow to drop these off. I'm really looking forward to seeing the new shop. I've not been up there since it's been open, so I'm really excited to see what products they've got and to see my beeswax wraps for sale there. But if you're local to Morpeth, head over to Eco Morpeth for all your plastic free shopping needs. There's some brilliant reusable products there and I'm excited to see what else is there. If you know of any shops that are local to you that you'd like to see my items in, please let me know in the comments below and I can see if they're interested in taking some of my stock. For a full list of my stockists, head over to my website, I'll pop the link in the description below, and you can find all the places around the UK that you can buy Drawn by Rhiannon stuff in real life. Obviously at the moment, with it being in lockdown, those shops might be closed, so just check out their website or social media to see if they're doing click and collect or what's going on with that. Obviously if you want any of my items, you can absolutely order them off my website, I'll pop the link in the description for that as well. Everything off my website is sent first class, and um, there don't seem to be too many delays with the post at the moment so they should arrive with you in a couple of days so not too long to wait. I print all my postage at home and pop it straight in a post box so that there's no contact at the post office or anything like that. That's it from me today. If you enjoyed this video please click the like button and remember to subscribe to my channel. Turn on the notification button to be the first to find out when I post new videos. I've got loads of ideas for new videos coming up but if there's any video in particular that you'd like to see just drop it in the comments down below and I'll add it to the list. So I hope you're having a wonderful day and I'll see you later. Bye!